What's up guys? Welcome back. Today I am going to be testing out some things I got from iMats and one of the things is going to be the Like a Boss palette from Violet Voss and then I'm going to test out that eyeshadow brush set that I showed in my iMats haul video and I'll link that video down below so you guys can see everything that's going to be coming up testing all this new stuff. Oh and I don't know if you can tell I got this new chair from Home Goods to film in and I can swivel around and it goes up and down to the little lever to go up and down. So I think I have it at like a good level right now and I feel nice and high up and you guys can see everything and I'm really excited about this new chair. I've been wanting a new chair like this and it's just perfect black suede with the gold buttons so we're using this bad boy today and this has 10 brushes in it so we shouldn't have to use any other brushes depending on the quality of them you know and i did clear out a section here on my vanity for these brushes i need to do a huge clean out because i have stuff in some of these drawers like this drawer right here i probably only use this and I use this sometimes, but I can't part with any of it. I'm like, I'm a hoarder of makeup. So this is the Like a Boss palette from Violet Voss. It has 20 eyeshadows in it. It costs $45. I love the box. I think I'm gonna save this box. And then it gives you like an extra box. This, I'm not saving that, that can go in the trash. So here's what the palette looks like, the front and the back and then you open it to this nice big mirror here and these gorgeous shadows. I'm going to swatch all of these two for you guys. So here are the top two rows swatched. We have Hustle, Baddie, Queen, Boss, Strong, Second Row, Fierce, Serve, Realness, Work, and Snatched. Here are the last two rows swatched. We have Woman Crush Wednesday, so WCW, Amazeballs, Girl Crush, Adulting, Motivate, Last Row, Swag, Extra, Smart AF, Royal, and Inspo. The top two rows are my normal colors that I go for, so I want to just dip right into these guys but I want to do something different and maybe use these two colors right here so we'll see what happens but my instincts and my love for you know browns pinks tans I just want to go for these top two rows but I'll try to do something different this opens up like so so then it tells us the brushes in order we have our medium fluff, our angle liner, angle fluff, detail brush, crease brush, large smudger, flat concealer brush, flat, flat liner brush, detail liner, and a dual brow spoolie. So this comes with a good amount of stuff. Ooh, so I'm not liking that already. That's kind of disappointing. The brush was like, do you guys see that? Let's see, that's... That's not good. Okay, so my eyes are already primed and I'm just gonna get right into this palette. And the first shade I'm going to go in with is Hustle here in the corner. And I'm going to put that in my crease. This brush is kind of stiff, but it's not blending too bad. Now I'm going to take the shade Serve right here and I'm taking that same brush and we're going to apply that in the crease as well to deepen it up. Wow, that is very pigmented. As you can see, I didn't even put that much on. So we're going to get this blended. Now I'm going in with the shade Boss with this large smudger brush and we're going to get some of that product and put this into the crease as well to deepen it up. And we're going to take that 
crease brush again and just blend that in. And I know I said I wasn't going to do something like I always do and stick to new colors, but we are not stepping out of our comfort zone today. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm going to take their detailed brush right here, and I'm going to take the shade Snatched right here and see how that comes out. And I'm putting this in the outer corner. Oh, wow. Okay. That is pigmented. That is more than I was going for, but it's fine. We'll blend it. Now I'm going to take their medium fluff brush and kind of just finish, get this color to a finish and buff it out. Hmm. And blend it and buff it into the crease. This side is just like so muddy. It's insane. Okay, so now we're gonna try to put a color on the lid just just to see if we can work with this. I'm using the shade Realness right here and I'm gonna apply that with my finger. I think that really brought the look together and these colors just needed some shimmer in it, you know? I don't think it looks bad. I don't think it looks bad. I don't think it looks bad. So here's the final look for the top of the eyes. I'm going to go do some foundation and then we'll finish off the bottom. Okay guys, so we have the rest of the face done and now we just have to do the lower lashes and some mascara. The lower lash line, I mean. <laughs> so I'm going to take that shade Snatched right here and I'm going to take this BX115 brush. This is their angle liner brush and we're going to use it under our eyes today and I'm going to put this right up against the waterline like so. Now I'm taking the shades Hustle and Swerve and we're going to mix those together and then we're going to blow out that color that we just put on with those shades. Ooh, I'm liking the way that looks. All right, guys, that is the final look for this eye tutorial. So I'm going to call this like a bronzy eye summer tutorial since we're getting close to summer. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am going to have to test this palette out a couple more times to really see how I like it. Obviously, the colors are gorgeous, so we know that. Um, a couple of that, that snatched matte shade, I don't know if it was just the brushes I was using, the way I set my eyes, so we're going to test that again because it was looking a little muddy. This shimmer shade looks beautiful. I really love it, so I'm excited to test out this palette a couple more times. But so far, first impressions, I do like it. I am glad I purchased it, so... That's how it's going so far. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Thank you for always watching. And if you plan on watching in the future, don't forget to subscribe because it's very easy to subscribe. You know, like just hit the button. All you have to do is hit the subscribe button and you'll always know when I upload a new video. How fun is that? So hit the subscribe button, okay? Hit it for me, and I will see everyone next video.